the top 20 reasons we chose our RV, the Adventure Travelers. After we sold our cruising sailboat, we were in the market for months. Part of our exit strategy with buying an RV was that we wanted to buy something that we could rent out when we're done with our travels. And we could do that with websites like RV Share or Outdoorsy. And so we decided the Sunseeker was the best option for us. The 30 foot Sunseeker is perfect for national and state campgrounds. It's very maneuverable and we've never had a problem. Love that you can actually get up from the cab and go to the bathroom. And this is what it looks like with the slides in. Lots of room. Room for two, side by side. We don't bump our butts anymore. There are two slide outs, one in the living space and the other in the bedroom. When you slide it out, it makes it really comfortable. Lots of room, but then when you slide it back, it's still roomy. You can still walk back and forth. I don't know if all the stars were aligned, but we got a kick butt bed. This thing's better than the one at home. And this is why I love the trash can. Ta-da! Okay, all you traveling chefs, this is what sold me on the Sunseeker. Tons of chopping rooms. You're able to take on and off so you can keep your space going when you're cooking. In the boat, I basically had a hole for my refrigerator. So this, I'm in love with. We were expecting about five miles to the gallon, but we actually get closer to 13 to 15. One thing I really like is that it has auto level. So you just hit this one button, auto level, and four jacks come down. Uh, from underneath the rig and it auto levels and then you just hit one button here to retract them all and it retracts It's perfect. One of the things I really like about this unit is All the televisions are 12 volt. So on a fifth wheel Our friends had uh, three televisions and they were all 110 so they couldn't boondock They had to have a generator all the time uh, we can use our battery power for these televisions and there's great hiding space behind each one. So we have one out here, one out there, and one in the bedroom. The rig sleeps at least eight adults. And not that we're gonna have eight adults on board, but it's part of our exit strategy to rent this out. So it makes it perfect for families who wanna rent it when we're done. I literally hate fold out beds. I'd rather sleep on the hard floor, but this thing is remarkably comfortable. And you may notice you can still walk by when it's fully out. We don't use a generator that often because we have solar power and uh, our batteries are always topped up and it's pretty good and it's really a very efficient rig anyway. But if we needed to, we can always turn on our generator and use it to uh, provide AC power. That's another thing, it's solar ready. There's some times that a fan just doesn't work all the way, ladies, you know what I'm talking about. So, Sunseeker has an amazing air conditioner. You just, a couple of plugs, and there you go. Boom, 69 degrees, yeah, baby. Or if you're like me, you can hit it one more time <laughs> and you got heat coming out. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> We've also used the Arctic package in Yellowstone when it was snowing. Although the lights aren't really mood lights, they do last a lot longer because they're LED. I actually bought a little lamp to plug in just for mood. We like the swivel seats in the front because it makes more room. I can fit three large pans on the stovetop and the oven is actually pretty large. So the reason why we chose a 2018 Sunseeker RV is because it's very technologically advanced. It has all the newest features. It has cable, it has a surround sound system, HDMI ports, has everything you need. And it's 2018, so. Um... When you're at a truck stop, that is what you need, full blackout. Yeah, baby. Hi, honey. Oh, what's up? Hi. 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 Hi.
Hey, what's up, baby? Yay, a shower tall enough for Mikey. The music on this video can be found at ccmixer.org. Join our journey and subscribe to us on our YouTube channel by clicking the little green go button. We picked out another video for you to watch up in the upper left hand corner. See you on YouTube.